I don't understand why there needs to be a divide, if I'm honest. Hence the title, why can't we all just be friends? Let's be friends, let's be friends. With benefits, with benefits, we can chill. What's going on guys? So we're currently heading to Fitness First Clapham Junction. Today is gonna be the first of the new training split. Proper excited. It's gonna be push day, when the 531 on chest. topic of this video is I had a question asking what's better power or hypertrophy I say this for a lot of things I don't understand why there needs to be a divide if I'm honest hence the title why can't we all just be friends everything has its use everything has its purpose and everything has its whoa that's crazy and everything has its, um, its benefits so it's not a case of ruling one out it's a case of knowing how to use both of them properly Downtown music on the beat. It's not something that everyone can jump into, but I know that I can handle a lot of sets and I can handle a lot of reps. I can handle a lot of weight uh, within one session. So yeah, it's just kind of gauging it to what you're doing. Downtown music on the beat. App that I'm currently using for calculating a 531 is 531 train. So it basically looks like that inside. You put your your current one rep max, which I put it in as 165 for the last cycle of this, and now I put it up to 175. Then it will break down week one to four for you. And you increase it after week four. Nice handy tool. I said utilize both when you're looking at both hypertrophy and power is because if you're wanting some people just like doing just straight power that's cool I'm all right with that but if you're bigger you'll be able to shift more weight because you've got more muscular mass so why not work with hypertrophy whilst you're working on just is my theory yeah. Final exercise, it's kind of what I do with the dumbbells but with the cables so there's like resistance on both sides and might do a little bit of triceps but I don't want to aggravate the injury from before although it's gone but yeah I'll probably just do a few tricep extensions really light really light and then um, finish up there all right So that was a really successful session, quite happy with that. Now, it's not too much different to what I've done before, but the fact that I've started this program and this is the road to the powerlifting meet, is just, you know, one tick in the box. Oh yeah!
the main thing to take away from this is you'll create a plan, you'll create a program and it might not be perfect. You're not shooting for perfect straight away, you're shooting for something that you can adapt to or change at some point but trying to get the perfect plan straight away is pointless. Write it, try it, if it doesn't work, change something. Simple. So this might work perfectly, it might not but unless I actually try it, no one will know. But ladies and gentlemen, that is the end of this vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Peace. Need to be in like at least you know like 2.5, like three grams per pound of body weight, protein. It's the only way you'll grow, mate. It's the only way you'll grow.